depression. Depression is a hidden threat. When you have anxiety, depression, or any kind of medical condition, then that's something you just can't ignore. Up. Depression is a hidden threat that needs to be unmasked. And it will require the help of everyone. Depression. Did you know that depression affects most of us? Did you also know that depression is a sickness that needs to be threatened? Depression is not something you just can ignore of or just brush off. In our society today, we see a lot of news like someone who committed suicide or someone died because of depression so you see depression is a very serious depression is a very serious medical condition it is very common you can see that it is that the persistent feeling of being sad or I mean the persistent feeling of sadness that usually do not go even after two weeks, the symptoms of depression vary. The feeling of being, the feeling of not worthy of everything. Uh, don't the feeling of, you know, just having no purpose in life. Next is suicidal thoughts. You think of like ending your life because of some sort of reasons then next the cause of depression is associated with an imbalance in the neurotransmitted or transmitter inside our brain the solution well we have two solutions for depression we have behavioral therapy and medication when you have a milder kind of depression you, you just can apply in behavioral therapy. You go to a psychiatrist, a doctor, you know, and that. Second one is when you have a med major kind of depression, well, you need the combination of the two solutions, which is behavioral therapy and an antidepressant might be needed. So you need some medication, you need some medicine to take, then you also go to psychiatrist. So now, knowing that depression can be treated, how do we solve the problem being stigmatized with that kind of illness? First is a paradigm shift. We need to treat depression as any kind or like any ordinary kind of illness, like cold, headache, or fever. One does not get shunned out of society of having a cold. The second one is to ask for help, which is go to a doctor or, or talk to someone you feel comfortable with. But I also know this for my own experience. We often then see that the happiest persons that will know, we know, more likely su suffering or struggling with depression. So when we encounter that kind, of situ that kind of situation, we need to let them feel that we care, we genuinely care for them. We ask them if they're fine or we need to talk to them. Now. Including to depression, you don't need to create another problem. Like in high school, the reason why students get depressed is because of failing grade or a failed blood life. So this type of depression is can be remedied, or you can just solve them. Like if you fail, you need to study hard. If you fail with your love life, you can find someone that will care for you. That is, don't 
drink alcohol if you're experiencing depression. It just can add up to your depression. In sum up, you need to be aware and accept people that have depression because depression is just normal. Depression and also it can be treated. So depression is depression, frustration or anxiety is just a natural part of the process of getting stronger, a getting stronger version of yourself. Life is hard, yeah, we know that. But during this situation, we will realize that we are not fighting alone. We are fighting together. 